the gamma Gompatz frailty model. Presumably the best known approach to model human mortality is the Gompatz model. The blue line here represents the force of mortality for adult humans over time, modeled with the standard Gompatz model. The real situation, however, looks more like the red line. The mortality curve levels off at the right end. We can assume that this phenomenon is caused by a multiplicative effect of unobserved heterogeneity on the force of mortality, which we also call frailty. The frailty leads to a compositional change of the population over time and can, for example, be gamma distributed. A frailty level of 1 represents the standard frailty, whereas larger values indicate a higher frailty and lower values a lower frailty in, respectively. The gamma Gompertz frailty model uses the Gompertz approach but can apply for the fact that more robust individuals survive longer, outnumber the more frail individuals in the late ages, and pull the average force of mortality down at the right end. Here are some references.